Hi, today I present a project that we did in DesignSpark PCB. We made a, made a small thermal switch based on diets instead of um, a temperature sensor. So we use normal diets as a temperature sensor. And the special thing about this project is that there are two sensors and the circuit decides on the difference between the two temperatures what it will do. So here we have a, on the board a relay, the big blue block that controls this little PCB, which is our display, battery powered. So it's a dry contact switching the power to the little PCB. Um, when the temperature on one of the diodes is higher than the temperature on the other, the relay will switch and the display will come on. So to show you this, I have a soldering iron here. It's a heated soldering iron. I keep it close to the diet and there it goes. You can see the LEDs are blinking. To switch it off, I heat the other diet. There you go. It's quite fun actually. Okay, so why would you need such, such a circuit? For instance, when you have a heating system with an outgoing pipe and an incoming pipe, you can measure the temperature on both pipes and depending on the difference between the, tem the, the airflow in the pipes, you can switch on or off a ventilator, for instance. The circuit is very simple. As I said, two diodes that take the temperature, an op-amp measures the difference between the two diodes, the temperature, the voltage over the two diodes. When the one is higher than the other, it switches the relay. And that's it. When the other one is temperature becomes higher, then it switches the relay back off again. It has one small adjustment point here. You have to adjust the circuit so that in when the both diodes have the same temperature, the circuit doesn't switch. Okay, so this project has been done in RS Components free uh, circuit drawing tool DesignSpark PCB. And you can download all the files for this project from the DesignShare website, of which the link is shown now. Okay, thank you for watching.